What is up, y'all? It's Jeff Collects, and today we're opening Shiny Treasure EX. Can't believe it. It's been one whole freaking year since V-Star Universe. That felt like yesterday, honestly. And now we're already in December 2023. V-Star Universe was December 2022. It's already been one whole year, and wow. This time, I'm not going to go too crazy. Last year, I went nuts, and I bought 12 boxes of V-Star Universe, but today, we only bought two. One to open for a video, and one to open with some friends, so... I'm uh, really looking forward to this set. I really am. Um, I've never really been part of the whole shiny hype. I didn't open Shiny Star V until way, way later. I wasn't there for the English Shining Fates and everything. So I'm really, really excited to check out what's in store for some shiny treasure EX. And I think it's kind of cute, you know? There's so many shiny Pokemon. It's really hard to master a set. But I'm really curious about which three random ones I'm going to get. So... Let's check it out. Uh, but first off, we have our card of the day. And speaking of V-Star Universe, it's a type of card that I'm kind of I'm kind of missing from uh, 2023. They only did this for V-Star Universe, and it's those those beautiful, beautiful V-Star alt arts. Look at that. Let's just get a bit of the card first. This is for sure my favorite V-Star alt art. Uh, this is Dark Rye right here by Pani Kobayashi. New artist at the time, and when I saw this card, I just fell in love with their art style. You got this eerie, really dreamy Picasso, I don't know, horror kind of vibe going on. It's crazy. Look at that texture, too. It's really, really wavy. And uh, I think this card is just incredible. The colors that they use, um, the story that it tells. I mean, there, we got the mind's door right there, and it really just entered, and it's about to give you some nightmares, man. You got the calm before the storm. And this dude is about to make sure that your next day at work is about to be terrible because you're going to get no sleep. Anyways, I just got off work and uh, I'm super sleepy, but I'm ready for some shiny treasure EX. Let's put this back in the sleeve. And uh, all right. Anyways, first of all, I really want to say thank you to everyone who has been watching and supporting the videos. I really, really appreciate it. Uh, the comments and everything. And uh yeah, thank you. Let's uh let's make 2024 an even better one. I mean, it's not even it's just the beginning of de December, but we got one month to go. All right, let's do this. Shiny Treasure EX. This is a uh, oh, they got a pole tab now. It used to just be, if I remember correctly, even with these high class small boxes, they used to just be the regular boxes, but now we got pole tabs. Cool. All right, anyways, uh let me know if you've been opening this and uh i've only watched maybe like one or two videos we're gonna keep it in the same order that was on the bottom uh i've only watched one or two videos so i don't really know the layout of these packs so we're just gonna check it out but yeah if you pulled something nice let me know uh look at that artwork i mean they're all 3d but it's a really really cool looking pack art i would have to say my favorite pack art from these high class sets has been v max climax it's incredible but this is really nice too I got, oh the little mimic is cute all right. Oh, that's Scizor. I actually never noticed that before, but let's do this. High class time is always a good time for Pokemon fans. And our first pack, let's get into this. We have our boy Relor into a Crocolar into a very nice Narumi Sato Slope. Really love seeing this throughout the year. Into a oh, it goes right into the Hollow. We have Jump Love. This is so cute by Niawa Kumina into an Electrode. A Nagamiso and our first uh oh it's gonna be our first baby shiny nice we have Grievard oh that is so cute look at that texture too dog this uh the trailer that came out for this Pokemon um was one of the cutest and most playful trailers ever I I enjoyed every single bit of it I love this Pokemon I love ghost type I love dogs and uh I love dogs that look super derpy and have no eyes so a very very nice into a all right, so we get a nice little EX Chiyu. All right, so you always get one of these, which is really cool. And then in the back, we're going to get... Okay, it's... How does this work? Oh, okay, so we're back to commons and uncommons. We have a Kilowattro into a Energy. Okay, interesting. So it starts off with two commons, looks like. Two hollows. Uh, maybe a baby shiny. I guess you don't always get a baby shiny, so I don't know... Let's just keep going. Whatever. All right, we got Gimme Gore here. Very nice by Okubo. All right, a nice small lit by Shibuzo. All right, this brings me back to January time when the first Scarlet Violet cards came out. We got Jigglypuff into a Professor Sada. Oh, okay, so this one doesn't have a baby shiny because 
this is the fifth card now toxicity all right what are into a oh, okay so this is the reverse hollow um it's kind of hard to see it's kind of glossy you can kind of see it right over there um kind of like this glitchy kind of style it's really reflective too it looks super smooth very cool jigglypuff all right into a noivern all right very nice noivern by nisota niso into okay into a b sharp and i assume these will all be cyclozar these will all be commons into a parachute looking thing okay cool all right next pack so high class sets 10 packs um but they are fatter than normal usually uh, japanese sets only have like what five or six cards in the pack we got Nackley into a pine i think i don't think i've ever seen this before pineco koki saito i might have seen it before gosh i'm kind of blanking out what set was this from okay this is uh is this pomo or is palma dang it i still can't i still i really cannot um get these guys i think this might be palma no it is pomo okay whatever all right we got dodrio on a Saki dynamic into a professor turo and oh we get a reverse it's gonna be a really nice akira egawa kilowattro yeah these are uh, pretty cool pretty cool kind of a uh, glossy effect really really nice into a kawaii iron oh sorry not iron tusk this is a uh, great tusk very very nice uh, i believe this is a new artwork too i think they reworked the artwork for both this and the iron treads into a nice gimme oh sorry gold dango by mitsuhiro arita i think this is a new artwork for this set too nice the return of mitsuhiro arita into a nice little letter into students and pandaya yeah new card right here new card really cool that um they keep doing these group group photo cards um this time we don't necessarily get like a friends in region card which i'm sure everyone is super hyped for it this time we only get students of paudea but nonetheless incredible artwork i wonder if the this is by naoki saito right really renowned trainer artists and uh i wonder if the full art is by them too i actually have not seen all right we have fido and a really interesting tetsu koyama varum into a little mastiff into a oh okay i remember seeing the shinji kind of slow bro it looks super super nice wow look at that is this how to uh is this the way that slow bro sees the world very very chill i really like it um uh when they have these kind of psychedelic kind of derpy pokemon it's uh interesting you kind of see the world from their lens and we get gets us into another grievar a very nice reverse grievar with a bunch of grievards in the ground and it's gonna be oh there we go speak of it uh we have a tori yufu i i'm actually not really familiar with that artist but we have an iron treads right here and i believe this is yeah it's a new artwork really cool not gonna lie i think iron treads great tusk both super awesome selections for um these uh future and past pokemon really really cool all right we have a dox bun into penny into the training ground okay nice all right into our next pack let's see what else we're gonna get we have a nice charmander from pokemon 151 Ghidorah. all right into a yukiko baba hopip a koki saito paudean whooper and a gosan clef key into another gosan car we have thunderous into a oh yeah let's go oh yes this is one of the chase yes oh i didn't expect that i thought you only get two commas in the beginning and then two hollows and then you get your baby yes let's go all right shikanori nagishi um really uh i think this is the pokemon that they were meant to draw like there's other uh, artworks that I've seen that I'm like kind of eh about, but this, oh, what a cute Snorlax. Look at him, just give him a hug. He's so small. Baby shiny Snorlax. Wow, a little Cabagon right there. Oh, yeah, let's go. Okay, so um, if you don't know about the set, there's like at least, I don't know, 50 something or more shinies. Like, I think a lot of Pokemon come in shiny, and you only get three per box. So. Uh, the fact that I hit one of the top five that I wanted to hit, I am super happy about this. Let's go. Look how happy Cabagon is. Little Cabagon. All right, Snorlax. Let's keep going. All right, that is a hit. 
into a, uh, what is this? Oh, this is Tinglu. First time seeing this card, because actually I did not open Clay Burst. It was way too much when it first came out with the Iona hype. So I've never seen this card before. Really happy to pull this. We have a Drift Limb. Or sorry, this is Drift Loon. Into a uh, Energy Snatcher. Into a Wug Trio. All right, really nice Kiyotaka Oshiyama. I love this artist. The colors are just so vibrant with the angles. Uh, one of my favorite cards by them. Got to be the Medicham V. I think it's a, such an underrated alt card. Uh, alt art cards. It's so good. All right. Nice. I'm really happy about that. Uh, <laughs> that really cute Snorlax. It's so adorable. Look how happy he is. Just really happy to be um, be shiny. Yeah. I don't know. I'd be really happy too about shiny. All right. We got Grievard into a Sprigatito. Into a really cute tandem mouse. All right. Just helping each other out. Haolucha by Yuya Oka. Into a really cool Nagamiso Palafin. Into a, uh, all right, this is a, I don't really know what this is. Sorry, but it's reverse. Into our, oh, ooh, cool. Okay, I forgot you can actually hit these tarot cards. All right, a nice chart. I don't have this card. Nice. Oh, man, the bordering looks sick. Wow, you all see that? Wow, look at that crystallized bordering. Man, this card looks amazing. All right, let's make another pile. We have shinies right here. We'll put them right here. And we'll put our Terra poles right over here into another one of these little walnut candies. Into a Graph I I. I actually don't know if that's how you say the name, but Graph I I into a really, really, wow. I feel like I've never seen this card before. An amazing looking Shiburino, Shiburino, sorry, I'm butchering the name. Shib this is the same artist as the as the Zapdos alt art, okay? In Pokemon 151. Um, but this is um, an incredible Murkrow. A Murder of Crows. Is that the saying? A Murder of Crows? Okay, I love it. Wow. All right. I really like this card, actually. Super nice. Okay. Uh, if I'm wrong, maybe it's been in previous sets and I've seen it, but I feel like I've never seen that before. Yeah. It could be in, like, a, one of those EX decks that I've never opened before. Uh, one of those random ones. So yeah, they, they have commons and uncommons in there that are only exclusive to the decks. And you can pull them in the English, but you can't pull them in Japanese. So, all right, a little shark deck into a Saito. Really funny voice in the show. <laughs> Saito, yeah. We got Strudel into a Bomb of Snow and a really clean Nagami Nijo uh, Sableye into our. And to A, hey, all right, our last baby shiny is going to be a super cute Snover. Oh, this guy's adorable by Saya Suruta. Such a little cartoony style. I love it. It's so cute. Nice coloring. Yeah. All right. This little, uh, this little, what, what is he? Is he like a little, he's like a carrot, right? Is that what he is? He's like one of those, uh, not carrots. He's like, yeah, those white carrots. I think that's what they're called. I don't eat vegetables a lot, so I don't really know my vegetables that well. But either way, it's a really adorable guy. Snover. Nice. All right. Into a. Um, oh, nice. Champow. I didn't really open this one either. This is a snow hazard that came out with Claver. Sorry, I was going to put the uh, Snorlax on top because Snorlax is the star of the show. Uh, but yeah, this is a really nice Champow into. Okay, into the town. A Naoki Saito Pachirisu into an ultra ball okay nice all right sweet pull on the uh the little snover super cute all right we got three more packs one of these packs is gonna have our big full art shiny uh rare card which i'm excited to see i think they're all super cool if i had to choose one i would choose uh clod sire let's try to go for a clod sire okay we got a star you right here into uh oh this is a really nice looking chibi ryalu yeah chibi incredible artist really um, and another incredible artist, right? Akira Igawa, a little Toxo. Into a Tinkaton. You know, I just read that this dude likes to hit rocks at Corviknights. It's kind of messed up. But then I also read that in actual, like, competitive Pokemon, this thing can't do anything to Corviknight. Very funny. Funny relationship. Anyways, um, let's keep going. Oh, this is two Anasaki Dynamic cards in a row. We have Garden Na Gargan Knackle. Nark Knackle. 
uh, hard to say name. And when we have a Kawaii little Flitto, so cute. All right, nice reverse on that. And then our rare is going to be, or our little EX is going to be Koridon. And two, a Kiyotaka Oshiyama Mabble Stiff. Very cool. Into a Hyogonosuke. Oh, I put these in the wrong pile. Oops. Into a Hyogonosuke um, little Mime Jr. And then a Fishing Rod. All right. What kind of Fishing Rod is this? Is this a good one or super? I hope it's super. Actually, it looks like a good. I don't know. Let me know. I, I can't read item cards. I don't pay attention to them too, uh, as much. Except for, if y'all remember, a Millie Cart cards from VSR Universe. I, I wish they did that again. But they did it. All right, we got Ralts by Tika Matsuno. <laughs> nice. Little fridge backs. All right, by Rika. Really cute. A Nagamiso Voltorb. A Sekio Bioplume. Into Toriyufu. Oh, so this is the artist for the uh, Iron Treads. Okay, I got to pay attention to him more because um, this card is pretty sick. I like this one. Into a, Oh, here we go. What are we going to get? Oh, okay, that is cool looking. Wow, all right. Skeledurge in the freaking super shiny rare. This is a sick looking card. All right, I like, I like shiny cards. Shiny is a universal language. And if you add shiny Pokemon onto it, it just doubles the shiny. And it just doubles the uh, the hype. Look at that. Oh, wow. That is cool, man. Look at that background. That is... um. I wonder if all the backgrounds are like that, but this is actually a clean looking card. Yeah. It looks, I mean, it kind of looks almost metallic with the background. I think it looks incredible. All right, let's put that on the side and we get a reverse. Yeah. All right. A reverse Murkrow that I really like into a Paldean Tauros into a um, chess piece. Okay. Oh, sorry. There's one more. Oinkaloin. All right. Oinkaloin is back. Akira Komoyama. Yeah. Akira Komoyama. Um, is that the dude that... Uh, I gotta look it up. Akira Komoyama. Miriam. It started a whole waifu craze. Insane. Okay. All right. Glimit into Toad School. Oh, this is the last pack, by the way. We have a Koki Saito Wingo. This looks really, really nice in that one water city. All right. Into a Kiyotaka Oshiyama. <laughs> Ditto. Cute card. And, all right, a Skull Villain by Kodama. And our last... Oh, it's not. Okay. We have a Reverse Okubo Gimigo. And our last rare, it's going to be a double rare. It's going to... Ooh, okay. Mitsuhiro Arita Alakazam. That is so sick. And I think... Is this the... I think this is the different version, too. Yeah, this is the one that you can get in, a, uh, in English from the Al Alakazam EX box. But then it was not released in Japan. And then now you can get it. Yeah, so really, really nice. And then behind that, we're going to get leftovers. I know this one. This is a re really important item in competitive Pokemon. I don't know if it is anymore. And uh, wow, this is a... Have I seen this before? This is a Pelipper Sleeping. This is a good card. I like this one. And our last card is going to be a Ghidorah... Arvin, that dude. All right. Okay. Anyways, that is our shiny treasure EX opening. Super happy about this Starlax. Yeah, this is a top five. Well, I'm probably biased because I just really, really like Starlax, but top five shiny, in my opinion, from the set. And really, really happy to pull it. Hopefully, next time in our other box, um, I try to pull a freaking Slowpoke. Yeah, let's go. Snarlax. Okay, anyways, uh, thank you so much for watching. If you got to the end right here, I really appreciate it. Like, comment, subscribe, and I hope you have a fantastic, fantastic December holiday season. All right, take care.